Authentic assessment is the measurement of intellectual accomplishments that are worthwhile, significant, and meaningful, as contrasted to multiple choice standardized tests. Uh, so many of our students can make the grade or score above the cutoff on standardized tests, yet we know they are lacking socially. It is a shame and unethical to rely sol solely on standardized tests or measures that we can quantify. The numeric result may make us feel more comfortable as we make decisions, but the test scores do not tell the whole story. Standardized tests are just that, standardized. In order to ensure validity of these standardized test scores, the environment in which the test is conducted must be controlled. Unfortunately, that really is the opposite of what happens socially. So go ahead and use standardized tests, but we recommend that you do not base eligibility or programming solely on these scores. What is the student doing in context, in the real world? That's what we want to know. To fill in that gap, we have listed some measures that, while they don't provide standardized scores, provide contextual information that is more useful for eligibility determination, goal setting, and planning. Within these measures, we find questionnaires to be completed by those who know the learner well. And in our experience, it is wise to have several people complete these measures. Others use guided observation, uh, such as the group play scale. The social thinking dynamic assessment utilizes guided tasks to be completed by, by the learner. While there are formal standardized measures of social skills, for example, the test of pragmatic language and the social pragmatic subtest of the comprehensive assessment of spoken language, many students do well on these measures. Their struggles with contextual social problem solving is not as easily tapped by these measures. There's a difference between having a social skill bit in place and being able to apply those skills to achieve social competencies. Your resources include information for listing uh, for the measures uh, and assessments that are listed on this slide, and that is at the end of this section.